you are looking at the most poisonous animal in the world. Welcome back, Charlie here. We all love animals. Some look so exotic and cute you might want to touch or pet them, but if you like staying alive, you should keep your hands well away from any of these animals. First, we have to look at this animal. This is a sea urchin. There are over 200 different species of this very spiky animal. If you see one of these when diving in the sea, do not touch it. There are two reasons you don't want to touch this animal. For one, it has spikes that can damage human skin. The second reason is that within these spikes is a poisonous venom. If these spikes punch your skin, then venom will be released into your bloodstream. A sea urchin sting is very painful. It will cause massive swelling and the stinger might even get lodged inside your skin. After a few hours, you will feel drowsiness, weakness, and your muscles will begin to ache. Sometimes people have even become paralyzed thanks to these stings. Sometimes these stings can even get infected causing people to lose their entire hand or foot. In some rare cases, the venom of this animal even takes humans' lives. Moving on, let's look at a very scary animal found above ground. This is the Brazilian walking spider. This is one of the most venomous types of spider in the world. These spiders can grow pretty massive at 8 inches long. Unlike most spiders, these do not build webs. Normal spiders build webs and wait for prey to land in it. But these spiders are much more aggressive. They crawl the jungle floor in search of food, hunting down anything in their path. Their Greek name is Phonutria, which means murderous. These massive spiders even eat things like rats and mice. They're also known for standing on their hind legs. They have gigantic fangs, and they use these fangs to inject toxins into their prey. These toxins cause massive pain. They also lead to your blood pressure either dropping or going very high. This will lead to your heart beating incredibly fast. You may then go into a shock reaction before passing away. So if you're trekking through the Brazilian jungle, then avoid this insect. It is definitely the most menacing and sinister spider in the world. Now let's look at an animal even more poisonous. This is the blue ringed octopus. It may look amazing and even cute, but that's why it's so dangerous. Many people make the mistake of touching these animals, but those who do, do not survive for long. These can be found in the Pacific and Indian Oceans. Blue ringed octopus are actually the world's most venomous animal. Just one of these tiny creatures contains enough venom to take 26 lives. They grow to be a maximum of 8 inches long. They're very slow moving and calm, and they look beautiful. This means many humans make the big mistake of picking these up. But when foolish divers and swimmers are bitten by these, they pass away. The bite of a blue ringed octopus is almost impossible to feel. By the time you realize you've been bitten, it will already be too late. Their venom is more than 1,200 times more powerful than cyanide one of the most deadly poisons known to man. If you're bitten by one of these, you will experience paralysis within minutes. If you're still swimming, this means you won't be able to and will drown. And if you've got out of the water, it means you won't be able to move your arms and legs, meaning you can't call for help or go to a hospital. Soon, you won't be able to breathe. You may also begin to vomit and lose your sense of sight. And after about one hour, you will pass away. There is no anti-venom for this bite, so if you fall victim to a blue ringed octopus, there is no escape. You'd simply have to accept that within an hour, you will no longer be alive. That fact alone makes this one of the most terrifying animals on the planet. Moving on, let's look at the Lonomia obliqua. It's actually a form of silkworm. They're normally around 2 inches long and are either green or orange. They are found in the jungles of South America. But why are these so dangerous? Well, they're covered in these tiny, hollow-bodied hairs. These can be dropped off and breathed in by any threat to this animal. These hairs are also so sharp they can puncture your skin. So if you ever see one, then never touch it. These are the only caterpillars in the world which are deadly to humans. Each of their stings also release toxins. You need to be stung around 20 times to receive a fatal dose of their venom. But they can do this very easily and very fast. 
especially if you were to touch one or pick one up. It's believed this animal has taken 500 human lives. If you're stung by one of these, you will experience nausea and vomiting after a few hours. And then 24 hours later, you will pass away. The scary thing about these is they look soft and innocent. Many don't realize how deadly they are until they pick one up. And by that time, it's already too late. Moving on, let's look at the Indian Red Scorpion. All scorpions can be scary and dangerous. Dangerous. But this is the most dangerous scorpion on the planet. These can be found in India, Pakistan, and Nepal. They're normally around 4 inches long, and come in a wide variety of colors, including yellow, orange, red, brown, and even blue. They're nocturnal, meaning that they come out only at night, but this makes them dangerous as they're hard to see. They exist in large numbers near towns and villages. It will inject you with toxins, which can be deadly. There is no antivenom for this scorpion, meaning that if you get bitten by one, then you won't make it out alive. Sadly, most victims of these are children. They don't realize the danger and then pick one up. Also, a very small amount of this animal's venom is enough to take a child's life. So whatever you do, avoid this animal at all costs. Next, let's look at the cone snail. Cone snails don't seem like threatening animals, but don't be fooled. Some cone snails are harmless, but others can be deadly. The reason why some are so dangerous is because they're so slow. They move at a snail's pace on the ocean floor, and because of this, they need a way to capture their prey. They use their tooth like a harpoon and shoot it into prey. This tooth injects venom into their prey. This paralyzes their prey almost instantaneously. Divers, swimmers, and shell collectors often pick these up. That's because they're known for their beautiful shells. But this can often lead to people getting stung and passing away. This tooth does not look sharp, but it is. It easily penetrates human skin, and can even pass through gloves. So far, cone snails have taken 27 human lives. If you're stung, you will be in great pain. You will also have difficulty seeing and breathing. After a few hours, you will experience vomiting, and then you will pass away. They have a nickname, which is the Cigarette Snail. That's because if you're bitten by one, you probably only have time to smoke a cigarette before you pass away. Even if their shells look beautiful, it's not worth risking your life to collect one. Moving on, let's look at Harvester Ants. Most ants are just annoying, but Harvester Ants can end your life. They are found in North and South America. The most deadly species is the Maracopa harvester ant. If one of these crawls on you or you pick one up, then you will be in grave danger. First, they emit pheromones, which summons other ants to come and attack you. Then they start biting your skin. They don't just sting you once, but many times. And each of these stings causes a burning pain which can last many hours. They also inject venom into you. And if you're stung more than 100 times, then this can be fatal. 100 times may seem like a lot, but these ants act very fast. And each year, people pass away thanks to these ants. Finally, let's look at the clownfish. Thanks to the movie Nemo, many people view clownfish as harmless and friendly. But be warned, clownfish can be very dangerous. The clownfish's appearance is actually designed to be a warning. Clownfish are known for biting humans to keep them away. They're also capable of surviving poisons from other fish. So next time you see a clownfish when diving, you might want to keep your distance. But now it's time for you to make your voice heard. Comment below which was the scariest animal in this video. If you want to see my short videos, then check out my second channel. I've been Charlie, thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And if you haven't already, then what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.